I just think he wasn't real happy with the first one he threw, so he wanted to get the field back for it. Hit back up the middle. And that is through into center field for a one-out single. That is third. Up next is Fernando Tatis Jr. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And solid contact there as this ball is belted high in the air out to left. Gone. He finds the short porch for a home run. The next one two pitch. That's ball three. Man, this guy's a grinder. Fouls off good pitches and doesn't seem to swing at the ones just off the corner. This guy's a pitcher's nightmare. The 2-2 two -two one more time. Back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And he is in there. And the run will score from second as now it's a 3 to nothing game. New inning set to get underway. And here comes the first baseman, Babe Ruth. Here's Oswald back to work now as he gets ahead of the leadoff man. No balls in a strike. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. A leap, but this is out of reach and off the wall. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Now back the third baseman. Into the box now, Ernie Banks. That should come up empty that time on a sinker at strike one. Flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. And a check swing. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. It's ball one. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. That's on the corner to put him behind now. One and two. And it's fouled away. The one two. Lying toward the gap in left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. As he arrives at second without a play, as also on the play. Stepping in now, Babe Ruth. Grounded foul off to the right. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. This is line to left. And that is down for extra bases as this will get one home and maybe two. the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from their starter. So now to the plate, Ernie Banks. One ball, no strikes to count. Runs outside, so it goes to 2-0 and now. 3-0 and now. Three runs already home here. And he'll just make him throw one over here. 3-1. and one. Hit sharply on the ground. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but it gets by the glove down the line. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. It's an 8-2 game. And back to first safely. Play. A run comes across to score. Standing in now, Larry Walker. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. Oh, and this just jumps off the bat here as this is to deep straightaway right field. And you can pretty much forget about this one. That is a long home run. Well, this is what makes this guy so hard to pitch to. He has that rare combination of speed and power. You don't want to walk him and have him get on first base. So what happens, you throw him a strike, and he can hit the ball all the ballpark like he did just there. Sergio Romo gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Cold strike on the change, two and one. Gutsy pitch right there. 2-0 changeup for a strike. Good call by the catcher. 
great execution by the pitcher. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. And not in time as the run scores. Swinging. Mike Trout goes quietly, and they've got only one out left. Hit hard up the middle. On to first, and that is going to conclude the festivities here tonight. Yeah, and that's what we've come to expect in these Diamond Dynasty matchups. Managers pulling the strings, putting their guys in the best possible situations to produce, and produce they did here. That was a